we've all been into like various games before and into those communities that play them. Uh, what games have you played that seemed like marijuana go hand in hand together? Because I'm playing a lot of Tarkov right now, and it seems like everybody I play with is stoned. And it's not <laughs> just because like everybody really? I know. It's, Tarkov. it's not just that, that everybody I know smokes weed. It's just like right. like I'm meeting new, pl- new people and like <laughs> I'm meeting like friends of friends and like people who play Tarkov and like that. The only way I'm meeting them is because they play the game and and. All we'll be about weed. to start a raid, and I'm like, all right, hang on a minute, let me smoke this Delta Eight, and they'll be like, yeah, let's all hit it. I'm like, wait, you're saying <laughs> I'll hear, I'll, I'll hear like three blow torches fire up, like a bubbler. <laughs> There's something bubbling in the background. Some guy's got a huge volcano bag. Like everybody's hear- blazed, and yep. and we're sitting there just doped up as fuck, like playing Tarkov. That's I always a, like a little Tarkov. bit of a bitch feeling when like you know you're like oh all right everybody's getting stoned okay and you like light your normal bong with flour and you hear a guy go like eat <laughs> like, the, like oh my god he must yeah, bro, have, be a chemistry the for the extract yeah, yeah. hell yeah. Uh, yeah the real the real game you want is the one where you're like yeah next round and then you hear like <laughs> 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 I was like, I'm done playing with the weed guys. Team Coke teammates, way more useful. Yeah. Coke team on the comms, bro. Coke that's team the on the comms go crazy. Crowd. They yeah. do that. That's, <laughs> that's what they're about. Yeah, the I, I like team it. on the comms. It, it usually leads to like a much more laid back, relaxed kind of thing because that game could get hectic, and I don't need people like hyped up and screaming all the time. On yeah, the top, I can't imagine anything worse than someone be like, "Bro, why don't we just stand up and run?" <laughs> you know what? Let's on just go with guns though, blazing. On weed though, it's so easy to be like contact one o'clock high. Yeah. <laughs> Me. Have you been playing any Tarkov? That new VoIP is so fun. I have to. I know. I, I knew they got a new update, so I got to get on it. Cause I'm like, now this is my chance to get back. Cause that's usually when new people come in. Yeah. And I need to run into new people. Dude, if you if you ever want to grind that game, like I've grinded it so much in the last two weeks that I'm like kind of. I'm real far ahead of, of like, Please, most, that'd be I, like, 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 like I compare myself to streamers. So I guess that's not fair, but like, I've got a lot of money and I got like all most of the tasks done. I'm like level 38 or something like that. I'm, I, I'm, I could give you so much free shit if you want to play. And well, I'm is, like roll with you on a roll behind you and just pick up all your garbage. Yeah. You do that put it on my body. I'll give you free shit, but the VoIP is funny because Tarkov players have a sense of humor. Like, like you can, and, and you can negotiate, you can you can talk shit, but more more often than not, I'm like, hey man, do we really have to fight this out? I'm good to do it if you want to, but this is all I got. We can work together and we can run this shit. And then, so most of the time, they'd be like, yeah, let's do this, and we will like party up and kill a third guy. That or like, <laughs> I'll just start saying crazy shit and try to make them laugh. Like I I got mm-hmm. in a fight with a streamer last night. I didn't know he was streaming, but I got to go back and watch the clip. But I'm like screaming at him in game. Um, I'm on the rocks above him and, I, and and he's shooting at me. And I've just got a pistol. He's got this crazy kit. And I'm screaming, I have the high ground. Give it up. <laughs> Give it up. <laughs> <laughs> that is an, Confess an incredible now. I mean, amount of surrender. pressure. And and he's such a fucking tryhard that he can't talk back and joke around. He's just literally like fucking fucking blind fire. That's a stuff. mental victory. That's a mental <laughs> victory. Like I played the hunt showdown, <laughs> and I used to do axe runs. And so it's mm-hmm. like it's kind of similar to Tarkov in in, a, in the way that you drop in there, you do your thing, and then you can escape or you can maybe run into some whatever. And I used to do axe runs, so I'd have the axe and I'd be rolling with another buddy. And we would know people are in the building and we'd be outside like hitting the walls with an axe and be like, we only got an axe, motherfucker, but we're coming. We're coming. And like you yell get through. and like people get, they get caught in their head. Even when I'm like there and I have like my gun. And if a guy's like, I got the axe, I'm coming to get you. I'm like, I can't lose this one. That would be uh, really <laughs> dumb. And you're like all like trying to be extra into it and you're not smooth anymore. That yeah. is a mental victory a hundred percent. And that's why I miss proximity chat and a lot of console games oh. they took it out because people are are just babies with it yeah, yeah. but Not i'm like this off. game's so toxic this game's so toxic people are like yeah hey. and i'm like yeah i love it so <laughs> rust is so rust is toxic it's an interesting like case study maybe like like the mentality of these two communities they seem very similar very similar games but rust has all these like really young kids playing and and tarkov seems to have almost exclusively like 20 year old guys and up and there's a lot of like 40 year old guys that play it seems like like ex-military and stuff like that are into it because it's kind of a simulator to some extent and uh i don't know on voip i've never heard anybody curse i've never heard anybody curse once or even say 
I mean, like, 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 you know, like, come on, bring it. We're going to fuck you up. Like, maybe they say something like that, like be competitive, like you would at like a basketball mm-hmm. game or something. But never is anyone like, fuck you, you slur, N word, N word, N word. Like, like, that's never happened. It's no, always I like, get, uh... I don't get the N words anymore, except in Insurgency Sandstorm. <laughs> I play that game and I'm like, bro, this sounds like so calm on PS2 headset. <laughs> the way people sound, and no disrespect, I don't mean this disrespectfully. Everyone sounds like Kyle, and they're Ooh. all dropping n bombs. And I'm like, "Yo!" I'm like in the headset of my girl. I'm like, "Listen to this." She's like, "That's really ugly." I'm like, "I know." I'm like, "This is how I grew up." As people <laughs> like, "Yeah, racism's overplayed." I'm like, "No, it's not, bro. You weren't there. You weren't <laughs> there in the parties of 2005. Yeah. The SOCOM games, bro. It, you weren't fucked. there in the COD Four lobby in 2006." Yeah. It was I, I grew up bad. in the Modern Warfare 2 lobby. The end bombs I blotted out the sun. <laughs> 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 That's what it was. It was <laughs> like uh, uh, the Tarkov people seem pretty chill on VoIP. It's not. It's not crazy, and it's been a ton of fun. It's really just fun to yell at people too. Like like when you if you run at it somebody, is. like you can start screaming at them, and it's actually scary. <laughs> yeah, that is. Scary. But you know what? I I you also know? what I dis what I dislike is when. I play a game and I'll like boot up a game, you know, um, probably like, like I'm trying to think of like one of the most recent tactical games I played, like in the last two years, maybe Valorant or something. And someone will be like, all right, boys, here's the plan. Let's like, you know, double, double, everyone rush B and I'm going to get one guy to go around to A and cause distraction. And someone else is like, whoa, calm down. You fucking loser. We're playing a game. Mm-hmm. And I come in and I'm like, no, bro, you shut the fuck up. I'm 36 years old. I'm playing this game right now. I'm not fucking playing to lose, bitch. This ain't no casual <laughs> shit. If we got a man here that wants to run the squad, you're going to listen to this man right now run the fucking squad unless you got a better <laughs> strategy. So are we rolling here or what? And they're like, yeah, let's yes, win. sir. I'm like, all right. Let's get you on plan. I'm like, Captain, no one would ever go ahead. That. The thing is, like, no one would do that in Tarkov. You know, if, if somebody's ever, like, all right, so we want to want to hit big red. Then we're going to cross over the main bridge. We're going to go low, cut across to our UAF, hit crack house, and head over to Stronghold. Sound good, everybody? Everybody's like, yeah, it's, that's a real good plan. I like it. Let's watch a right flank. Sounds good. All right, let's go. Like, like nobody would ever be like, what are you, fucking try hard? Because, like, yeah. if you're playing everyone's tar- try hard, every- we're all trying so goddamn hard. We've been there all day. Like, like it's so many hours. <laughs> it's so many hours. Like, you can't just play that game casually. Like, pop in for a game. Fuck you. Let me ask you this, Kyle. Uh, I don't play that much Tarkov just because I have a ton lately, but all of my friends got who got into it said that they did because of like the realism aspect of like the weapons, how fast people go down, the fact you can use tactics. Do you think a lot of like the Tarkov crowd is mature because there's kind of this understood like we're all grown up like children who just really want to see guns be cool and like accurate in a video game? It's a, it's a lot. I mean, grown up. I, think, ch- I mean, grown up no, children no, no. in the best way. You're by not the way. insulting yeah. me. We're all grown up children here. Like, like, yes. like yeah, uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, I, it's a lot of things. I think. I think that it's it's that the the player base uh, comes from a lot of adult background shit because it is kind of a simulator and it's been an alpha mm-hmm. and then and now beta for so long that I don't know. The people who play it and have been playing it for a long time, they know the struggle. They 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 know the game. It, uh, that's true of Rust too. I don't know. There's just something mean, immature, and nasty about Rust, and there's something almost like respectful uh, in in Tarkov between like enemies. Where like now that Voip is there, you can actually hear it play out. You can be like, "Hey, man!" Like you could like meet a guy. You both shoot each other up. You're both like now in uh, opposite rooms patching up your bleed like hey man that was pretty rough yeah dude you scared the fuck out of me uh we could play this out a couple different ways you know like yeah you could leave yeah you could leave wow you you can like talk that shit out it's funny man that's pretty wild okay yeah um and then on the other hand like like people be like i'm coming in there and i'm gonna fuck you up (laughs) (laughs) i'm gonna take all your shit man just so you know i'm gonna take all your shit and if i can't carry it my boys are gonna carry it and uh, we're gonna take it 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 that's the coke that's when you run to the coke squad yep no (laughs) no negotiations we decided we are killing (laughs) yeah oh and you can take prisoners now too because like like there's 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 the element of there's scavs in the game right guys who are like playing Mm -hmm. who have bullshit no armor and no and you can be like yo Mm -hmm. man stop right there Get your knife out. We won't kill you. And he'll be like, "Yo, dude, just don't kill me. I don't. I don't want to die." He'll do it. Yeah. He can't fight back against four PMCs. 
So the dude will just like drop his shit and you can make him do stuff. And you oh, no. you- suck our dicks. <laughs> You can you can make them run into the minefield, right? You like if you can cross the minefield, you get to live. Oh no! Or you can just be a real piece of shit because it's like a simulator game. Like you can just shoot him in each kneecap and leave him there. Like oh good, <laughs> this is pretty. People sadistic. have a war sim for like a year and already are committing war crimes. Yeah, so like as yeah. fast as possible. Yeah, you, you can cross the minefield and suck our dicks. <laughs> Shoot him in the knees, might let you boys. Go. He's like, I'd rather. This game log. sucks. I've been a POW for months. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I log on, We've I'm getting you. beaten with even... reeds in a cage, like John McCain. <laughs> you, you joke. Can't but... do the YMCA anymore. You joke about that, but honestly, if there were a system where, like, you could go into a game mode where it was only squads, right? It was always five versus five versus five versus five, maybe five teams of five. Uh, and uh, like, like, let's say we like. We shoot your guy and like like we break his legs and you you leave him behind. We're able to put hands on him to count coup. We could take him prisoner now, and I don't mean just in that game. Like now he can't play Tarkov. His 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 lobby <laughs> takes place in my stash. When he logs in, he's in a little cage in my stash. And You're I, peeing and, on him, and he's watching me like sort my fucking <laughs> items. And the only way that he gets to play again for like. I don't know, half an hour, an hour, it depends how what I did, maybe, is if his boys like pay a ransom. Like, like they gotta mm. they gotta give me a Bitcoin if they want him back now. Otherwise, Damn. he just gets play. You should be able to pee on his wounds <laughs> in that game. Yeah, I yeah. Know. yeah.